Hello everyone, welcome back to Ecom Sutra. And in this video, I will show you how to change page title and meta description of your Shopify store pages. So, page title and meta description are two important elements of own page SEO for any website. And Shopify understands this. And this is why it, it allows you to customize it and optimize it as you want. Okay. So, going beyond, I will show you the steps on how to change, where to find the options to change the page title and meta description of different types of pages on your store. But if you want best practices and tips on how to create SEO friendly page title and meta description, you should refer to our Shopify SEO guide in which we have gone through in depth instructions on how to create SEO friendly stores. And we have also talked about how to create SEO friendly title and meta description for your website. So this is for the home page. You can use it for, you can refer to this for home page. You can refer to the fifth point. Okay. And for the seven, and you can scroll down to the seventh point for the product and other types of pages. So you will find this option such as an interesting preview and you have seven tips here to optimize your to create SEO friendly. So I won't get into this in uh, into the best practices in this video. Maybe I will create some a new video on this topic. But for this video, if you want to learn the best practices, you can refer to this. You will find the link in the description. So make sure to check it out. Now let's go back to our Shopify admin to change the page title and meta description. So first of all, to change the page title and meta description of your home page, go to online store and then click preferences now in the first section you will see title and meta description where you can add home page title and meta description so let's say my store name is sutra box now this should not be left with the store name only you can include your primary keyword a tagline or something to make it more compelling and SEO friendly so let's say my uh, my primary keyword is on gift boxes so i will i can add best buy best online gift boxes so this is my home page title okay this is what will appear when someone will search for sutra box okay so this is the page title and similarly you can create a meta description but before you edit or you add meta description make sure to conduct a thorough keyword research for e-commerce to find the target keywords for you know your products and other other types of pages okay and if you haven't done it you can check the link in the description where we have linked to our complete guide on how to conduct keyword research for e-commerce site so make sure to go through that guide and create a list of your target keywords and then optimize the page data and home description for your store okay now next if next just click on click the save button and it will be done right next if you want to change the meta description and title for products just go to product and then open the page you want to edit you know open the product where who's uh, you want to change the meta description and scroll down to search engine listing section click edit and here you can add it now you will see that shopify uses your product title and product description as your default page title and meta description so it is automatically created but you can edit it and customize it as you want so let's say i want to add gift boxes by best gift box in India so this is my page title similarly you can edit meta description as you want okay so as I said keyword research is the key to to create a you know SEO friendly meta description so make sure that you do the keyword research for each product and pages for your store okay before getting into that okay again I'm saying just check the link in the description you will find links to some helpful resources and you it will help you create SEO friendly page title meta description similarly you can go to the blog posts and open the blog you want to edit now scroll down to search engine listing preview and click website SEO. Now here you have the fields to add the page title and meta description. Now similar similar to products and other types of pages, Shopify creates the description page title based on your content and the page title. Okay, so it does it by default, and if you want to change it, change it or leave it as usual. 
okay so this is how you do it similarly you can change the page title and meta description for pages and for the collections and gift cards as well but here you will notice that if you have hundreds of pages hundreds of product pages hundreds of blogs and every and you suddenly decide to change the product title and meta description for every page just imagine how time consuming and how tiring it would be right and you don't want to go through that and this is where you can use Sofi seo app Sofi seo apps allows you to automate the creation of page title and meta description based on a specific rules that you define one of the best seo app that i found is search by and this is the best one literally the best one that i found and you can find the link in the description click the link in the description and you will land here once you land here click add app and install it once you install the app you will see this dashboard here where you will find all the uh, reports and recommendations so once you click once you click here you will find all the recommendations that recommendations that you need to do to optimize it for seo for specific if it also recommends you for all sites let's go through to seo text this is where you can change the page data and meta description for your store so here here you see you can decide the rule for home page meta tag, right similarly you can create rules for product collections blog and blog post. so in simple words you don't you won't have to change the page title meta description for every page or product page by going through them right you can just create rule and this rule based on this rule the page title and meta description will be created right now this is the default this is the default um, rule that like it will include page title shop name page description but you can also create your own rule okay now you can add here for this you will have to add right this is the page description and now if you will go to save it Now, if you will go to products, then you have the option. You you will see the rule is page title, like it will be the it will be your product title, and then shop name that is Sutra box, and then the product description shop name. So, if you want to keep it as it is, you can keep it, or you can create your own rule. Like I want to start the page title with my product title, and then I want to add hyphen, and then I want to add uh, product type and product vendor and so so you can also add some imp, you know you can add some text as well to make it more friendly reader friendly so let's say my product is gift box so gift box and then packaging boxes from the vendor name and then by sutra short by sutra okay so let's say i can add the differentiator here and differentiator here as well okay now this is how the page title for my product pages will be created right isn't this cool i won't have to change it every time i create or i every time i add a new page uh, every time i and every time i add a new product so it's that simple right similarly you can do it for collections blog and blog post okay now if you want to do it manually then you won't have to visit every product page this app provides you one screen one dashboard from where you can change the meta tags for every product available in your store you can also change the meta tag for every collection in your store similarly for the blog post so basically this app saves you time and helps you automate the creation of seo friendly page data and meta description based on specific rules so now you have two options whether you want to do it manually or you can use search by Shopify app to automate things or create the meta tags manually from one screen so pick how you want to do it i have shown you two ways and now it's your call i hope this video helped you if so please do hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more tips and strategies and i will see you in the next video soon thank you